Jackson Cartwright. Questions for those two? Alonzo, third go around. How do you feel like you get back out there? Fun, you know, it's always an exciting time of the year. Red and blue, um, introductory to the team, to, to all, for our fans, and uh, you know, it was a really fun game. Excited to go do it again. Warm, okay? Yeah, sorry, just a little strange. We all right. That was a chemistry so far as a team. I think it's great. Um, it's a lot of different characters on this team. I think everybody meshes pretty well, from the young guys to the older guys, and I mean, it's just pretty. It's just a, it's a fun environment. Um, playing with each other and on, on and off the court. Practices must be uh, very difficult or good or whatever, what, competition-wise, because there's a lot of talent there. Is that true? What is your thoughts on yeah, that? that's, 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 that's what's great about having um, uh, depth and a lot of talented kids is that we get to compete at each, compete at a high level every night against each other, and you know we're pushing each other, you know, trying to make our team reach new heights. So, um, you know, we're really grinding, really grinding, and uh, pushing each other. Alonzo, what's your take on Brandon's game? And, and it seems like you, you guys can play a lot together. Maybe. I think he's a you know great young guy, uh, really talented, as uh, all of our freshmen are in, in different, unique ways. So um, I think he's a, another guy that's going to be implemented well into this basketball team, and he'll do a lot of good things for us. For either, either one of you two, have you guys ever seen a player like DeAndre? Uh, no, no. Um, I think just physically, he's just way more far ahead. Yeah. Uh, I, I think it's anyone in the country is going to be a tough task to just to just battle down low with him because he's so big. But on top of that, he's so smart um, and unselfish. And when you when you when you have a great talent like that, that is unselfish, um, you know, it's, it's really special. Yeah, to piggyback on that, basically, like, as you can see, it's really weird to see somebody that's that physically imposing can run, jump, you know, move the way he does. So um, not there's it's rare to have bigs that can have that all, all that combination. So he's really tough. So he puts a lot of pressure on our bigs. But you know, having a guy like that, you know, really makes our um, our bigs get talents every single day. So that when we go against other teams, um, they should be they should be well prepared. Anything else? We you guys feel like it, it does does the getting on the court like this uh, for you guys? I mean, is, is the court any more of a sanctuary kind of thing than it is always? I mean, it, this year with all the distractions going on outside, et cetera, or is it, just, does it feel the same? We feel like we're playing basketball, and having a good time. It's what we love to do. It's what we came here came here to be a part of, and we're going to continue to work and try to get better and, and and go after our goals for this basketball season. That's all we're worried about. But does that? I mean, it, it seems like. Uh, everything going on. I mean, you still have obviously, a, you know, an impressive team here. Obviously, and, and do you feel like that, that maybe that that that's getting not talked about enough or anything at this point? How good we are? Yeah, we're not worried about that. We're worried about we're getting better every single day and being the best team we can through October and November, and then you know to the start of this season. Parker, what have you worked on defensively? Because especially in the first half, it really seemed like you were kind of everywhere, got after it, steals, etc. Yeah, I think just um, being more of a pest, trying to trying to pick up and use my uh, my advantage of being small and quick and quick with my hands. Um, no big changes. Just trying to be tougher and more of a pest. Did you know Alex Marcel had hops like that before he came here? No, not actually until last night when he showed me a video of him uh, doing the the uh, windmill dunk that he did tonight. I mean, yeah, I didn't, I didn't know. It was a surprise. Was that, in, who was did that, you guys think would win the dunk contest before you saw all the, all the dunks? I originally thought DeAndre was going to win, um, right. but he actually like backed out on what he was going to do. I don't know. He's a little uh, nervous for you know and excited, so um, he had a change of plans of his dunks. But I think all of them did a great job of putting on a great show for the fans tonight. We, did any of that surprise you? I mean, you, you've probably seen plenty of Brandon. Than his athleticism. I mean, anything happened in that contest? That um, I think they. Maybe? I think. I mean, we we all seen pretty much knew what everybody was going to do. So it was more of a surprise for the fans. But you know, we know how, you know, the type of athletes we have on this team and the type of players we have. Parker, going up against Marcelo, what has impressed you the most about his game, and what do you think he adds to the team? Uh, I think his shooting ability. I mean, tonight, he. I mean, obviously, we were off as a team from three, but I mean. I mean, Zell could piggyback until you guys. I think he's one of the best shooters on the team. 
and he showed that through uh, preseason and this first month of the season. Um, and just how poised he is and how eager he is to learn and, you know, listen and implement all the things he gets from the coaches and us as players into his game. So. The other point, how has the other point guard rotation changed at all as far as what you guys, who you guys are working with or with Alex and Emmanuel? I don't know if Dylan's playing there at all or what's that been like? Yeah, um, there's a lot of guys that can be interchangeable in that position. I think Coach does a good job of making adjustments throughout the year and putting guys in different positions to, to help the team and, and themselves. So, um, you know, the rotation is, is what it will be. Anything else?